Now at 11, a possible motive and a deadly home invasion. Authorities are still looking for Shannon Gilday right there. He's from Taylor Mill and is accused of killing a woman in Richmond, Kentucky this past Tuesday. Kentucky State Police now looking into the possibility that he went to her home because it had a doomsday bunker below ground. WCPO 9 News reporter Jake Ryle has the latest details. Shannon Gilday's mother, Katie, released a statement on Friday. She's wanting her voice to be heard loud and clear for her son to turn himself in. Katie Gilday penned Friday words from a mother, words from the heart, saying, quote, First, I want to state that I am greatly saddened for the Morgan family, friends, and loved ones for the pain and suffering it is believed by the police that my son has caused them and especially for the loss of their daughter, Jordan. It is a terrible tragedy, end quote. Kentucky State Police believe Taylor Mill native Shannon Gilday, Katie's son, forced his way into a home Tuesday morning in Madison County, Kentucky. Very shortly after making entry, uh, almost immediately, Immediately, that's when those shots started being fired and Miss Morgan was um, was fatally struck. Police say Shannon killed 32 year old Jordan Morgan and then exchanged gunfire with the homeowner before he took off. After the shooting, it appears that uh, there's a possibility that he was injured. We obtained Madison County Assessor public records, which show some of the exteriors of the home. Friday, a clearer picture coming from Shannon's mother on Facebook. She says she tried getting him psychiatric help and that he hadn't been of sound mind the last couple of weeks, adding that he is distraught with the certainty a nuclear war is imminent. He spoke of building a bunker and the CIA following him. Kentucky State Police say it's possible the house he targeted has a bunker inside and that's something investigators are actively looking into. The public records show the home but make no mention of the possible under ground bunker. And while we don't have permission to show you, we have seen multiple pictures inside of the home of an underground bunker. We'll put a link on WCPO.com. Jake Ryle, WCPO 9 News. Well, police continue the manhunt to find Shannon Gilday. He's believed to be driving a white Toyota Corolla with front end damage. A Kentucky license plate of 379 VMJ right there. If you see this vehicle or Gilday himself, you're asked to not approach the vehicle or him. Just call 911 and let authorities do their work.